Hi everyone, this is Raluca and welcome back to my channel. Today I thought I would do a what's in my bag video for you guys. I am going to start off by showing you the bag that I wear most of the times. And this is a bag, I'm going to insert some pictures and footage over here, but this is it. It is a bag that I purchased at TJ Maxx a very long time ago. I actually purchased one that was in a brown shade and I liked it so much that I went back to get another one as a backup. And um, they didn't have the brown or black anymore. They had this uh, reddish maroonish kind of shade. So I got it anyways because I like the style of it and I liked uh, the bag a lot. It's made by a designer called B. Makowski. But anyways, enough about the bag. Let's see what's in it. First thing I'm showing you is the wallet that's in the bag and it's this one. Uh, it's all beat up too, but I like it. This one is also so soft and it's by the same brand and this matches the color of the first one that I had that um, you know I used up I like how it has a zipper over here so you can put stuff here there's nothing there now the inside I have uh, you know license credit cards and all of that good stuff stamps membership clubs like Sephora Ulta one thing that I got for Christmas which I really really like it's a coupon book that's in my wallet that's from Dunkin Donuts and I use this a lot on my lattes and coffee and sandwiches and stuff when it comes to my pocketbook I could be like Monica you know Monica from friends yeah that's pretty much how bad it gets you know the phrase they have in friends when she goes to a restaurant and she works there and uh, she comes home and she's all excited she tells uh, Chandler her husband that the restaurant is not only clean it's Monica clean <laughs> that's my bag all right the next thing that I have here is uh, another another pocky and this one has a bunch of coupons um, yeah coupons that I get in the Sunday tell in the Sunday paper I have right now it's this one for the yeah, like a body wash, and this one is by, for a deodorant that I use, so I kept those. So yeah, if I don't keep this in the, the coupon in these bags, and I chose one of the most colorful bags, because if I don't do this, then I will forget about the coupons. It happened to me a bunch of times. I ended up going to cash out and I forget about the coupon, so. And then I get so pissed outside, I'm like, I can't believe I forgot about that. Okay. Next is this. Um, there are uh, facial toilets, basically 15 uh, makeup remover toilets. These are pretty good. I found them at uh, Sam's, I think. Yeah, and I bought this big, huge box of it. But I have this. This had 15, so this is like a travel size. And then I have like six big ones. Next thing is another Bucky. And I got this at TJ Maxx. I liked it a lot because the lips and the eye is um, actually uh, embroidery and I thought I was gonna wear this as a it's called it's made by a brand called fluff and I really have um, they really have some cute stuff I'm not sure which one is their website right now but they have some cute stuff and over here I usually like to keep all of my receipts all organized I told you I'm organizing freak okay and so that's that and uh, besides my wallet I have another little coin purse from the same brand fluff so cute I love this brand a lot when it comes to accessories and things like that I keep the cash and the loose change in here well look what I found wait I like this chocolate a lot this is a chocolate made by a company called Lily Sweets and you know I'll try to stay away from sugar and all that stuff and this is sweetened with um, it has no sugar added and sweetened with stevia I find this at Whole Foods and sometimes at a local grocery store and but I highly recommend this you go try this 
they have this is uh, they have dark and this is dark but then they have milk too they have one salted caramel milk right now that's fantastic i like to have in my bag a cream that's like a multitasker like this because i don't want to have 100 little creams with me this works great let's see what else in the front pocket i have the car keys Ooh, i have a honda honda pilot this is one of the most important pieces that it's in my bag this is my phone samsung note 5 i think yeah and this is the case I think I got this on eBay for like three dollars, but I love it. I'm a huge fan of Hello Kitty. And here's another baggie within the bag. I have a scissor and a nail clip. I can't be without this because if I have a, a hangnail or anything like that, it drives me crazy. And I ended up pulling it off ever since I implemented this. No more problems with my nails. Oh yeah, and this nail file. It's by Margaret Dabbs, London. It, the, the writing has gone off of it. But oh my god, this is the best nail file ever. I throw away all the others I had previously because this is fantastic. And last, but certainly not least, is this makeup bag that I carry around. I have all my makeup and you know very different different stuff in it they have it at tj maxx and i believe they also have it at target i like it because it has a lot of compartments uh on the outside and then it has uh, separators on the inside too i have a bunch of minis in this pocketbook because i don't like to carry a lot of heavy stuff uh, i have this dry shampoo most of the stuff i got through my sephora play and ipsy so this is one of them this is a dry shampoo and volumizer this is really good i'm considering getting the full size of this i have this mirror with me with the black key on it next thing in here is this this isn't a lip balm this is a uh, deodorant from secret this is something new they're doing and i'm glad that they are it looks like this and Mm, smells good but this is awesome and of course uh, this is a perfume automizer that i can fill in with whatever perfume i want next i have a lip balm this is a, a lip balm by K kaplan md this is really good it has a minty fresh scent and it's spf 20 and this is really good i have a lip gloss by sephora a lipstick if you want a little bit of color this is a lipstick by dior and it's really pretty it's a really pretty shade uh, of red but it's not too strong i mean it kind of goes on sheer this is some stuff from a brand called Trestique, i think and uh, i think that's how you say it and one is a highlight and the other one is a uh, concealer I think that this brand has a really cool idea with these things because they're slick and you can put them in your bag. This is a blush and highlight two-in-one. It's really, really pretty. It's, uh, it has um, like a peachy shade and highlight within it. This is a Trio Eyeshadow by Pacifica because I have extremely hooded eyelids and if I don't apply um, a dark shade in my uh, crease then my eyes end up looking really really droopy and these are the brushes that I carry around with me I got these uh, from this is a, sh a regular eyeshadow brush and this is a crease brush I love these. I got them from CVS. Usually I have a, an Avon catalog because I'm an Avon rep. And how cool is this catalog? I really like this catalog of this month for Avon. And usually a book or something if I get bored. So right now I have this one uh, by Terry Cole Whitaker. What you think of me and it's none of my business. <sighs> this is a pretty awesome book. I highly recommend it especially if you especially if uh, you do youtube and you deal have to deal with a lot of negative comments um 
this this is a really good one and this is my Dunkin Donuts coffee who isn't in my bag but if I could I would put it in my bag it's really really good today I got French vanilla so that is it that's what's in my bag at this present time of course a lot of things change except for maybe my wallet and my um, receipt uh, bag that I always have there like that uh, makeup always of course changes if I have a lipstick that I really like that day I will throw that in there thank you so much for watching if you like this video please don't forget to give it a thumbs up uh, don't forget to subscribe and we'll see you in the next video bye